Hi, how are ya? Welcome back to my V-Boy vlog. Yeah. I'm Dizzy, a 12-time world champion, a threat style pioneer, a global B-Boy activist, and you're watching the Dizzy Diaries B-Boy Vlog! So today I'm going to be talking about a topic that a lot of people always ask me, they're always asking me about, how do I find my own character? I'm going to share with you the lessons that I have learned over the 23 years that I've been breaking about finding your original character. So for example, people who have a very strong character that everyone can just see right off the bat, somebody like Casper, or someone like Issue, he has his own type of character, right? Cloud's another person who has his own type of character. And people want to strive to have a character that's just them, that as soon as you see anyone act like them, you're saying, hey, you're copying that person. So of all the years that I've been breaking, I learned a lot of lessons. Most of the lessons that I learned were the hard way. So in regards to finding your own character in originality, this is what I've come up with. I believe that there are two ways to go about finding your own original character. Uh, the first way is to just simply be yourself. The reason why is because every single person out there, every one of you out there is original, is unique in because yo, know, we're all created different. Okay, there's no exactly two of the same exact person okay whatever experiences you learn in your life is going to make you a certain way it's gonna... so if you just be yourself a confident version of yourself you will have your own original character now there's a drawback of this the whole drawback is that we're continuously changing each person if you're not changing if you're not growing that's actually bad okay we want to continually grow so for example when i was young i was a very cold silent conniving type kind of person and you know what I, I, I found pleasures in evil things like hurting people's feelings so when I was my character back then was very like my hat was always low nobody sees my eyes I just come in and do my thing I joke around a bit and then I'll do like something and I if I see somebody get it, getting their ego pop you'll see me smile like yeah <laughs> that was my character before but as I grew up and I changed my character started to change I didn't want to hurt people's feelings anymore so I went through my own internal struggle where I was like how am I supposed to be now? You know, and the hardest thing is when you're overthinking yourself. When, when you know, these voices come into your head and tell you weird things and then you don't know how to act. That's one of the hardest parts, right? To not be able to be free. So if you go the whole be yourself kind of thing, you're going to continually go through this, this changes in your life to, and you're going to have to continually reevaluate yourself to see who you are. I can't go back into my old frame of thought, right? But there are certain things that I can take from my past, bring it to who I am now, which is, you know, sometimes when you battle, you just gotta get angry. And when I battle and I'm angry, that's just the way that I really feel at that moment. I'm angry or I feel disrespected or my pride is, uh, and that's the reason why I'm like that. It's not an act. You know, I'm really genuinely upset. <laughs> so my point is, be yourself, but be ready to be continuously reevaluating who you are and then expressing it through the way that you dance. Now, the second way is a totally different way. It's a totally different approach. It's where somebody can put on a mask, okay? Not a literal mask, but putting on a mask and be somebody else, okay? So for example, if you wanted to be like Spider-Man, right? You can put on a mask and you can and you can you could dance like him. Man, that's a, that's the amazing thing about breaking and this culture is that you can be who you want to be. It's like your own escape. It's, there's nothing wrong with that. Right? For example, if you wanted to be Wolverine, right? If you want to be Wolverine, you can, right? You can put on the Wolverine mask and you can be exactly who you want to be. And that's why this culture is so awesome. So yeah, so those are the two different ways. Okay. To give you an example, I have a homegirl. Her name is Lucy Love and she's been a, a friend for a while. And she's also been my student, a B-girl from UK but living in Seoul for the past how many, how many years? And I've been training her and I've seen her come a long way seeing her develop as a B-girl. One of the things about her, like many B-girls that I know, is that uh, she has a little bit of self-confidence issues. And not, not just girls, but B-boys have it too. We, you know, even I do, I have it as well. I started explaining to her just a couple of days ago that she can put on a mask, you know? And the cool thing about her is that she is an actress, right? She actually went to school, finished university for acting. I told her that it's okay for her to put on the mask of who she wants to be. And, I, and one of the things I suggested, because I saw one of her shows, is to be like a girl, you know, like a, like feminine. 
And I said, it doesn't have to be her, but one day there's going to be a B-girl out there that's going to be super feminine with all her moves, but still killing it in the B-girl styles. And I told her, you should be the one to try it. So in the last three days, she's been messing around with it, and I think it's awesome. I'm going to play a video for you to show our yesterday's practice. Now, I just want to explain to you that I believe that in order to really find yourself, okay, to really find yourself, people ask me this all the time, what do you do when you're stuck? For me, the best thing to do when you hit that wall is to cipher and exchange with other people, okay? Ciphering and exchanging with people is part of the culture, okay? This is the culture, meaning that when someone goes out and does something, you look at what they do and you absorb it and you respond by showing your version of it. Of course I have my stuff and I want to show who I am too, but at the same time, this is how you break through that wall to know what you need to work on. So here I am kind of cypher exchanging with her as she's doing the sexy bugle styles. I have my own kind of responses to that as well. Okay, don't laugh. I don't always do this, but I'm showing it to you because I think it's funny. We had a great time. In the end, I think she won the whole cypher that we had. I was going after her majority of the time because that's what I like to do. I just like to like see people and I like to take what they do and show my version, you know, show, show my responses. She was actually been getting better at responding in return. So I hope you like this video and yeah! So here we got Lucy Love coming in. She's taking out the makeup. Yeah, goes into freeze right on the beat, okay. Now I'm watching her very intently to see what she does so that I can respond to specific moves or points. Like right there, that little drag right there. Okay, I saw that. I'm like, hmm, I have something for that. Oh, and she gets up sexy. So I later on put together exactly how I'm going to respond by putting on my makeup and also brushing my teeth, spitting it out. <laughs> okay, oh, the sexy touching and arm thread go down. Okay, now into my little footwork, now I'm getting ready, and ooh, response to the leg drag, quattro threads, and gonna respond to the freeze, boom, pink, okay, now here comes Lucy coming in again, okay, I'm watching her at another time, oh, two, look at that twerk go down, I'm going nuts, okay, oh, sexy getting up, boom, oh, head freeze, oh, combo, nice, I'm gonna try to respond to that head freeze combo, and what I'm doing is I'm just looking to see what I remember. Now, I'm, because I'm going in right away, I'm trying to respond very fast, so I only have a few seconds to really think about what I need to respond to. And the music drops, so I just slow it down. Okay, and I'm gonna respond to her head little freeze. So here, boom, little new combo that I'm trying to work, our new variation. Bink. Okay, and then I, a little bit of sexiness, go back into my flying footwork and I don't remember what I'm gonna do so gargo freeze here comes Lucy coming back again okay I'm watching her clearly seeing what she's gonna do what does she do oh nice go down oh she's going into the oh look at those sexy thread styles all right very cool right I like those oh those little positions and threads goes back down all right Woo. Pink. okay so I'm gonna try to respond right away so I'm just going right off the top of the dome oh little thread go down oh and straight into the response okay my little thread combo of death pink nice and I forget what I'm gonna do. Think. And here comes Lucy again. Now she's getting a little funky. I'm watching her very clearly to see what she does. Okay, nice go down. Always trying to figure out what to respond to. One of the hardest parts is watching and saying, hey, this is what I'm responding to. So I see the sexy get up. So that sexiness, I'm responding to that. It's just bringing the sexiness out of me. Look at me doing the little Oh, slide down the pole freeze. Nice. <laughs> okay, and I'm going back into my stuff. I decide that I want to go into power because I just want to try it because I'm responding to actually somebody else at this point. Freeze. Okay, just trying it. But if you see Lucy, she's getting up and she's going to come right back in, cutting the other two guys off. 
just to respond to me back with her power. Nice. Look at that, right? We're, we're dead tired. We were dancing for I don't even know how many rounds we were already going. And we're both going for it, which is awesome. In the end, that's how it's done. And thank you very much, everyone, for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And now you know how I like to cypher. For some super awesome hip hop products that supports me and what I do, please check out my Dizzy web store. Links in the description below.